It's easy to see the challenges the teachers and students are facing during the pandemic. For schools that depend on hands-on education, it's essential that they make some changes. News Center Maine's Sam Rogers shows us how new technology is helping future nurses learn to do their jobs. A virtual simulation lab or a video game? A new virtual reality program at Beale College in Bangor looks like fun and games, but it's serious. Simulations are an integral part of nursing education. This virtual reality pilot program allows students to interact with patients they would deal with and equipment they would use in real life. It has been very effective here. Clinical hours and hands-on experience are crucial for nursing programs, but tough to clock in during this pandemic. The nurses that are in the field really needed to focus on doing their job and, and they didn't really have the opportunity to, to host us for clinical experiences. Limited opportunity on hospital units sparking creativity at this nursing school. Victoria is the name of the mannequin. A live birth mannequin used for countless other scenarios. The students are then able to react and uh, make those critical thinking decisions that nurses need to do in real life. The state of the art equipment at this small school in Bangor helping its students fill a big need statewide. Folks can start and, and really help with the nursing shortage that we have uh, in our local area statewide and giving future frontline workers a head start so that they are ready to hit the ground running when they uh, graduate from us. Graduating from the simulation lab to real patients across Maine. In Bangor, Sam Rogers, News Center, Maine.